Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is Bigfoot Spider here. As you don't know, or if you guys do know about it, um, for the people who don't know about Area 51, it's a secret military in Nevada, and no one knows what's going on in Area 51. No one probably will know unless they uh, tell everyone what's going on inside there. But there is one guy. I'm gonna read about it couple minutes so um let's get started I'm gonna read uh that page in this page but you guys can't really see it um so uh yeah um first off I'm gonna we like said I'm gonna read them two pages down as you see on the top left corner I think it's you guys' left corner uh it's about the YouTube spy plane I will be saying some more stuff about YouTube spy plane on this the second page right there um, as you can see, some of the, uh, stickers are, I mean, yeah, stickers are missing. I have to print some more off and glue it on there. So, guys, let's get started and first start off on this page. Let's, let's go, let's begin. Area 51 is a military base and a remote dispatch of Edwards Air Force Base. It is located in the south of Nevada. Or, ne or I think it's Nevada, I'm not, I'm not really sure how to pronounce that state. It is 83 miles northwest of Las Vegas. Situated on its southern shores, shore is a, is Lake Groom. The base primary purpose is to support and develop testing of experimental aircraft and weapon systems. Through the name Area 51 is used in official CIA documents other names used for the base included Dreamland, Paradise Ranch, Home Base, Water Tower Strip, and Light Groom. It has an area of restricted airspace known by the military as the box or the container. Groom Lake was used for bombing and artillery practice during World War II. It, had, it was then abandoned until April 1955 when it was chosen to be the test testing place for U-2 spy plane. Security is provided by uniformed private security guards. They drive camouflage jeeps and Humvees. The guards are armed with M-16s. However, deadly force has never been used. Fines about $600 seem to be the normal course of action. Okay guys, I'm going to start on the, uh, about the U-2 spy plane. Um, as you can see, I mentioned about the testing ground. Air Fisherman was testing ground for U-2 spy plane. Read more about the U-2 spy plane, what it's nickna nicknamed. Um, sorry for that, guys. As you look up there, um, that's some pictures of U-2 spy planes. And I will be having more pictures after I read this. Um, I'll show some pictures about it. And all the pictures of Area 51 and stuff like that. So, guys, um, let's get started on this page right here. I'll read it and I'll begin right now. The U-2 spy plane lockhead, the U-2 lockhead spy plane. Sorry guys, I got stuck up on that. The U-2 lockhead spy plane is nicknamed the Dragon Lady. It has a single engine and flies at very high altitude. It was designed to fly at 70,000 feet so the Soviet fighter missiles and radar couldn't, could not reach this would allow the U-2 spy plane to take aerial photos. The first flight occurred at the Groom Lake test site on August 1st, 1955. The, in the 1980s, the base increased in size. The runway increased to a total of six miles. The runway is rumored to be the longest in the world. A worker named Bob Lazar claimed he worked in the base in 1989. He claimed that Air, the Area 51 UFOs, Area 51 was testing extremely advanced aircrafts and UFOs. They got by trading with the aliens. Since then, Area 51 has been known through to be the test center of captured UFOs because of light lights from that have 
been seen from the night skies. The government has closed many of these viewpoints of Area 51. These, there are two large antennas. Okay, guys, two large antennas. Um, there's some words right here. I'm going to read these off. And then, uh, as you see up top of here, that's a uh, Area 51 sign. And up on the hill, you guys can't really see it. There's a truck. Here's a satellite picture of Area 51. And that right there is, uh, a real picture of Barry 51. You guys can't really say it. So let's, 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 I'm gonna read these two and I'm gonna show you the pictures. Area 51 is restricted area. They have sight signs for the public. These are warning signs. Okay, here's about the large, two large antennas. One is said to be the world's largest movable antenna. Okay, yeah, that's all I have right there. So guys, I'm gonna show the pictures and I'll come back to you. So, hope you enjoy the pictures and peace out. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed the photos. Um, I'm just going to tell you a couple more things. Um, it might not involve Area 51, but I'm going to tell you a couple more things about Area 51. Uh, they have known the aliens, things in night skies. Um, no one knows what's going on in, uh, in Area 51, except the people that work there, but you're not going to tell no one where they'll get fired because they'll someone will kill them. Uh, so, yeah. Um, as you see, um, there's one photo about this airplane, uh, it's like a, uh, I don't know what to call it, not a 747, probably, I don't know what kind of airplane it is, but it has like white on top and like a red line going through it, that's one of the airplanes, airliner, that takes, I think it leaves, um, some airport, uh, near Las Vegas, and it takes them. From that airport to all the way to Area 51, I guess they have all blacked out windows so they can't see where they're going or landing. Um, if you get on Google Earth, I might make some videos about Area 51 on Google Earth. Um, there is a couple um, uh, airplanes, it's like right beside the runway, it's like a white airplane, the airliner, like the picture you saw. So yeah guys. Um, so hope you enjoyed this. So please um come around and subscribe and so hope you guys seen uh the zombie um theater mode. I mean that's that's awesome now in uh zombie gameplay. If you haven't, uh well then you just gotta have to go look watch it because it's it's beast. So yeah guys, like I said, please come around and subscribe and I don't, I almost have enough money to uh buy an Xbox and pay off Call of Duty Black Ops 2 Harden Edition. So yeah, um, please comment, rate, and subscribe, and peace out for now.